So, you know, I got to accept. He can say what he want. He in love with that girl. We all. Welcome to T. Jones TV, where we mind the business that pays us. It just happens to be theirs. With that in mind, remember to like, comment, and if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Now let's go sip some tea. Going to take his clout, drive him to the mud, and I'm gonna be the star. I said, Rock, you know who you telling this shit to? She said, Whack, here goes the problem. The dumbest thing he does that he does is he don't listen to you. She said, Whack, this mouth and this pussy got that nigga. He ain't gonna listen to nothing you tell him until it's too late. But you will save him. You real good at doing your job. I see you save him all the time. She told me that. I swear to God, she told me that. And I watched her work her hand. So you know she is who she is. But one thing I can't take from her, she's a little hustling ass bitch. She hustle. Once she put her mind to something, she going to do it. I'm telling you, she will kick her shoes off, jump on the roof, nigga, and, and force the window open, climb through to get in the house. Like, Rock is a tomboy at heart. Straight up, that's her. That's it. She's like our black Cardi B. Only Cardi is feminine, but you know how Cardi talk? Cardi ain't trying to correct her speech or her language. She don't give a fuck. That's rock. She don't give a fuck. Nigga, we made her put on some heels one day. Nigga, she took four steps to them shits and kicked them motherfuckers out through the bitches out the window and got to it. She had walked very for the first. That's her. Nigga, she got like, she said she used to watch her father take her mama to the woods and tie her to a tree and, and beat her. She's the girl that been through some shit. She been through some shit. But that's just her. And if you not that type of man, that know how to deal with that, she gonna run circles. Any of these little fake rap niggas, she running circles around them niggas. It's a fact, all of them. She gonna run circles around them. And if she get with a mature nigga, he gonna get tired of watching her because she's a nigga. She's like a dude. She'll go fuck and come back like ain't nothing happened. When y'all heard that nigga say, you didn't fuck 10 niggas in the last couple months, that nigga wasn't lying. He wasn't trolling. Like, so you got a female nigga that's ratchet, talented, sophisticated, conniving, and slick all in one. Straight up. That's what you're dealing with. Yikes. That, not fucking with that. I know what that is. Yes, I could have made her a humongous st nigga. You just heard me, Larry, tell you I passed it to a nigga. Larry, you know I don't pass up on no bag. Shit. I ain't fucking with that one. It's just slep rock. Something's going to fucking happen. That's what that is. Everybody was blaming Blueface. I said, yo, get away from her. Stay away from her. He had like five months. He wasn't nowhere around her. You see, and all her shit kept going. She started attacking her sisters. She started attacking them people. She kept doing that shit. Wasn't no Blueface around to blame. Blueface has her doing no, 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 no. That's who she is. And she'll tell you that's who she is. Nigga, she'll lie. She'll tell you. I'm like, why you lied? You blaming me because you was dumb enough to believe it? That's her mentality. So it's no now, return for her. Now when she ran in the R&B, she got this motherfucker fooled. Right? When Blueface thought I had to get him out of the Vegas jail the first time for the attempted murder, they made the nigga go on house arrest, so I had to go get Airbnb out here. She came out. Me and R&B go over there. R&B's like, I think you're wrong about her. She's sweet. Yeah, all right, bitch. Going over there for a couple days. Y'all be fighting. She up there cooking tacos. Hey, how you doing? I'm like, yo, this motherfucker right here is dangerous. Okay, sweetheart. Okay, sweetheart. But, again, I think she's a young female who's never had trust, guidance, she never had, she don't know what it felt like to genuinely just be loved. Somebody always was 
doing something to her or with her or using her for something. Not what I see. Yeah, so I'm seeing it. I see it all. So I'm like, Blueface, if you going to be that, be that. But if you going to hustle with her, you can't hustle her because she ain't crazy. Rock will play dumb on you. She will play dumb like she don't know what's going on and be plotting on your ass the whole time. Anybody that thinks she don't know what's going on, that she's stupid, your ass is going to lose at the end of the day. That's a fact. Ain't nothing dumb about that girl. She know exactly what she doing. She know how to plot, plan, execute. That's a fact. And now she got a name. He didn't gave her a name. When he did the show, I told him. When Lemmy called me, he said, Whack, you got to sign off on the show. I said, you know, can't nothing move with Blueface if I don't sign off for it. I don't give a fuck what you going to do. I'm all on the show. He called me. Oh, come on. Come on, man. You told me that you would teach me how to do your job. And this is my client. And, you know, you supposed to help me. And I'm looking at the nigga. I said, bro, you sure you want to do this? You know what it's going to do, right? Once this happens, your control is out of here. You get your paperwork done. She's my woman. I don't need it. Okay. That's not the type of business I do. You want me to sign off on it? Fuck it. I said, let me bring me a little bag. What let me bring me? So what I charge, let me. I got out the way for 150000 like, for some punk shit. I said, give me 150. I won't have nothing to do with none of it. Y'all keep everything. Signed off, and nigga, there it went, there she went, and there he went. And that's what it is today. That's it. Now I'm like, all right, if I don't find something for her to do, every time he's making a power move, she gets mad, especially when it's with this, this baby mama, Jaden, and she come over there, she, she calls him, butters him up, <clears throat> get him right back into Charlotte's web, and trick bags him. So I said, okay, I'm going to put her in the situation. I'm going to do what I could have did from the beginning without having to do it, hands on, right? So I called bro, got them on the phone, conference call, got them talking, got them to agree. So by now they should be doing their paperwork and everything, and she should be preoccupied. He should be preoccupied, and hopefully everybody the fuck could, could just go their way and get the fuck along. Real shit. I'm talking about Adidas endorsements. Four motherfucking boxing matches canceled. Uh, all kind of shit. Nigga, I lost. Nigga, I will get a cancellation. I wake up in the morning to a cancellation letter. The fuck? Yeah, the domestic violence situation that we see on social media that occurred last night between Blueface and one of them, the bitch hit him dead in the face. He ain't even touch her. We still got booked. We lost $2 million in motherfucking London. So, nigga, I got to get her. I said, nah, this shit ain't making no sense. I got to put her somewhere because you, every time you, well, I'm growing. Yeah, but she don't like that. She needs you to keep her thing going. I need to create her business for her where she doesn't need Blueface because the people gravitating to Jay's music. They gravitate to Rock's bullshit, toxic shit. So we need Rock's music to be elevated so then she don't need to reach out to Blueface. That's what need to happen. And I told him I'm doing it for your own good. Nigga, I just signed a $200 million contract in the Congo on some diaper shit. Whack making his move. I'm making my move, nigga. I'm finna get the fuck so far over there somewhere. I ain't gonna see none of this shit. But I need to make sure you straight regardless. The only way that's gonna happen is for you to be on one side. She gotta be on the other. Maybe when y'all both where y'all need to be, maybe y'all come together. But right now... You two motherfuckers is tearing each other shit down. Rock shit go, you tear down. Your shit go up, she tear down. I'm pulling up to one of my cribs and five police is in the mall. Like, you know I ain't used to no shit like that, bro. Five police in the house. I can't, look, like Larry, I couldn't even reverse out the driveway, Larry. I had to literally get out the car and walk in there while these police looking at me like everything is normal. 
this shit is too it's too crazy. Like I hit the, you know the house was in the cul de sac dead end. I hit the motherfucker block put in the driveway. I got a police at the end of the driveway on the motherfucking stairwell in the house. I couldn't even go in reverse. They gonna tell me stop. Right, Larry? You know how I stay. I gotta jump out like I'm in church, knowing damn well I'm fucked up. Hell no. Hell no, nigga. You heard everything got to go. This motherfucker like everything is normal. That's crazy. Thank God for the baggy hoodie. Yeah, fuck that. So, you know, I got to accept. He can say what he want. He in love with that girl. We all done seen this shit. We done had a female. Y'all done had a nigga in y'all life. Y'all know what the fuck going on. Nigga, you are in love, sprung, whatever words you want to put. Nigga, she got your number. That's a fact, so, you know, hopefully this shit work out. But I ain't want to gossip, so if anyone asks you, you ain't heard it from me. <laughs>